Carol with a look at this morning's weather. Hi, Carol. Good morning, Sally and Billy. Good morning to you as well. Today, well, for most of us, it is going to be dry. Now, this morning, we'll see the best of the sunshine. There'll be a bit more cloud around as we go through the afternoon. And we also have a weather front which has been producing rain across northwest England, western and northern Scotland. And you can see how it remains across the north. Then the next one comes in. But as this one comes in and bumps in against the high pressure, it too will weaken. So through the course of the overnight period, we've had the rain coming in across northwest Scotland. But for Northern Ireland, Northern England, Wales and the rest of England, it's been largely dry, bar one or two showers. The first thing this morning, there's still a bit of cloud around, but that will break and we'll see some sunny spells developing, especially across England, Wales and Northern Ireland. Eastern Scotland, you could see some for a time, but the rain persists across the northwest. So into the afternoon across the southwest of England, although there will be more cloud around, we'll still see some sunny breaks. Across southern England, generally through Essex, East Anglia into the Midlands, a similar story. More cloud around, but there will still be some sunshine here and there, allowing the temperatures to get up to about 16 degrees. More cloud across northern England and also southern and eastern Scotland, but the heavy and persistent rain continues on and off through the day across the north and west of Scotland. Here too, it will be breezy. For Northern Ireland this afternoon, well, largely dry and bright, but that I mean there will be areas of cloud around at times. And for Wales, you could catch the odd shower, but again, most of Wales won't. So through the evening and overnight, there's our weather front coming in and heading slowly southwards. It's a fairly weak affair and weakening all the time as it does come south. Behind it, there'll be some showers, it will still be breezy. And ahead of it, there'll be a fair bit of cloud around. Temperatures, though, tending to hold up. So tomorrow we start off with that weather front across southern Scotland, northern England, northern Ireland, slowly moving south. And remember, as it bumps into this ridge of high pressure, it will continue to weaken. Behind it, brighter skies, some sunny spells and a few showers, still breezy across northern Scotland. For the rest of England and for Wales, we're looking at, rather like today, at times more cloud, especially so through the afternoon, and brightening up with just the odd shower across Northern Ireland. Then as we sweep into Friday, it's going to be a cold start to the day. Here's our weather front in the south. That will clear off onto the near continent, and then behind it, fairly quiet once again. Variable amounts of cloud, a few sunny spells developing, the odd shower. But later in the day, we've got this next system coming in, bringing rain to the northwest. And if you're taking part in the London Marathon on Sunday, on current thinking, it will be a chilly start. There'll also be some cloud around in the morning. By the afternoon, there'll be some sunny spells developing and we expect temperatures to get into the upper teens. But do stay tuned to the forecast for that one, Billy and Sal. So are you taking part in the London Marathon on Sunday? Billy, do I look like a runner to you? <laughs> well, you could be. It's the first time for everything. <laughs> the answer is no. I'm more of a cyclist. Next year. <laughs> Just say no now, Carol. No, you and me, no, you and me both. That one. You and me both next year. That's a deal. I would rather stick pins in my eyes, frankly. OK, you do that first and then do the marathon <laughs> office. Carol, thanks very much. Oh, thanks, Pimple. You're mean. <laughs> it is at 8.47. It is the world.